The battle in the Darklands turns into a slaughter. Of those that fought, we only know that Imric survived, carrying with him a dire warning for any that will hear. This warning strikes like thunder across the world, urging them into action, none more so than the dwarves of Everpeak. High King Thorgrim Grudgebearer calls for vengeance against their fallen kin, for the shame they brought on all dwarves with their atrocities. He declares that no pure dwarf will stand to allow any of theirs to serve the dark gods of chaos. Thus, a huge throng from the Silver Road and Slayer Keep marches into the mountain passes to the east to stem the tide of chaos and purge their fallen kin before Hashut gains dominance over the world. Tsar Boris the Red joins them with the armies of Kislev behind him while Vlad von Karstein throws his undead legions into the fray. Man, dwarf and undead shall remove the taint of chaos or die trying in the attempt, such is the oath of the High King. Among this huge host stand the two greatest heroes of the age, Gortrek and Felix, determined to help stem the tide of chaos at any price. In response, Iron Hand, the Black and the Ashen take to the field together, gathering all of their strength, all of their magic, and all of their artillery, and massing it in the Dead Rock Gap to force open the way to the west. They will not allow their feeble kin to stand in their path to glory. Hashut will have his victory, no matter the cost. Dwarf will fight Dwarf in the battle that will determine the fate of their entire race, on whether they shall be a free people or forever bound by the chains of chaos. <laughs>